John says uh, Kirk Cousins is terrible. Yeah. He, he is awful. Yeah, Kirk Cousins is terrible. Stop it. Yeah, Anyone okay. thinks Kirk Cousins is terrible so is stupid. out of their mind. So stupid. Right. Yeah, right. Yeah. You but, like that? No, I, you I like that? <laughs> no, that was great. That's a great meme. As far as a quarterback? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Dude, 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 that was – I don't care what anyone says. That that was a magical run he made with the Washington football team. Here, 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 here. Sure. Here's magical. The, here's the Hasn't terrible, been done since. Here's the terrible quarterback that everybody says Kirk Cousins is. Career, 67% completion percentage, 28,000 yards, 190 touchdowns to 84 interceptions, and his passing rater, rating is one amongst the league's best. Okay, this yeah, is I mean, this is a terrible quarterback. You, terrible. You, listen, this is he, terrible. He, I, I understand where you're coming from, Tyler. Honestly, I do because Mitch Trubisky's been sketchy at points. But that run you with mean Cousins, Washington. Oh, yeah, yeah. Sorry, Cousins. Um, Trubisky can't be mentioned. No, no, yeah, no. That was my bad. I slip of the whole thing because of idiot Errol talking about Trubisky. <laughs> but the run he made in Washington was certainly magical. No, I, I, I agree with that. And I don't think it's any mistake the miracle in Minnesota he was the quarterback for. He, no, it wasn't. Case Keenum is, was. Dude. Yeah, that was Keenum. That was Keenum. Oh, was it Keenum? Yeah, it Cousins was. came yeah. over the year after. I just, think, I just think he makes a lot of good plays, man. I think he's like... He's a good quarterback. He, he, yeah, he, 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 he has, he has moments. My problem with Kirk Cousins and my problem with the division foe he has to Aaron Rodgers, they don't... Ever. You are an idiot. Don't even mention Aaron Rodgers because you make me sick. They okay? don't overrated win Aaron Rodgers. Big games. That's why uh, the, anything that, that he close. says about quarterback position. He thought Baker Mayfield was the second best quarterback no, in the two no, years ago. No, yes, he did. No, no. Speedy? I projected Baker Mayfield Phil- to be the second right, best Tyler, quarterback. Tyler, Phillip Rivers doesn't win big games either, and he was thought of as a top 10 quarterback, so I can't Of all time. Of all Kirk, time. The, the talent. The, he is not top ten. Uh, top ten. I don't think I, I don't Numbers think he was Philip Rivers. I don't think he's Philip Rivers either. But that doesn't mean he can't Phillip be a good Rivers quarterback. No, I didn't say he wasn't good. Philip Rivers is okay. one the of the league greatest quarterbacks right now. Of time. You're crazy. No, I'm not. I'm just saying there, he's, he's not even. He's not even better than Dan Fouts. Mm. He's yes, he's better than okay. Dan Fouts. Oh, yes, you're not. The point I'm trying to make is you could be a good quarterback and not be a clutch quarterback. He is good. He is good. But to me, he's not top ten. And to me, we're pushing it if we say top fifteen. No, he's definitely top 15. Top 10's a little bit. Uh, he's definitely top 15. What are talking about? Cousins. I would need the list in front of me. I Cousins could argue is definitely he's 15. Definitely, definitely 15. 15. He's probably on the brink. Kirk of Cousins 10. last year was a top 10 quarterback. Go look at his numbers. Top 10 quarterback last year. And, and, and b- believe it or not, how many quarterbacks do you know in the last five years that have thrown more yards and more touchdowns to interceptions in, in, in the league? Besides, he's amongst the league's top six, top seven. Yeah. Right. The last five years? Last five years, yes. Rodgers, Brady, Breeze, Big Ben. Mm-hmm. I mean, but, Probably but Philip like, Rivers. Think, of, think, about, think about what Matt you're Stafford. doing. Matt Stafford. Matthew Stafford has not. You're, putting him, in, you're, you're, not. Putting him in the, you're naming the elite class yeah. in football, and then you're putting him in that class. Breeze and Rodgers and Brady. Whatever. That's pretty damn good, dude. Right, yeah. but I don't understand. And by don't the way, Philip Rivers, how deep the quarterback. By the way, Philip Rivers, the past ten. Philip Rivers is a top ten quarterback of all time. Okay, just so you, you can know. think whatever you he want. Is. I go think look. you're insane. Absolutely, go look at his numbers. But again, absolutely, we're not even saying With that zero Kirk- Super Bowls. He's top ten uh, again. It, it, you it, Super zero? Bowls have to do. With teams, Tyler. It's not just one so player. So Eli Manning's top 10 all time? No. Because Eli's got better numbers than Phil Rivers. No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't? No, he doesn't. Does he have more the... yards? No. Does he have more touchdowns? No. Mm. No. Go look. Not even close. Nope. Go look it up. Carl, I'm good. Carl, Carl says Cousins can't beat a quality team. Snug says Kirk you. Cousins. That's, thank Kirk you. Cousins it's like always. his number one Achilles heel. Kirk Cousins make great sound bites. Carl says he's only won one Monday night game or Sunday night game, right? Yeah, it's it's Monday night. That's his, his uh, kryptonite, I guess, mm. in that sense. Uh, Rick- Eli Manning doesn't beat Cur- Philip Rivers in any statistic. Any statistic. Go I'm look. Not, not even any statistic. Yards, I completion am. percentage, touchdowns, to interceptions. It's not even close. Uh, John he beat also- Tom Brady twice. Uh, he's not even close. John More also- than Philip Rivers I mean, again, beat him. Again, that's, that's going to, uh, you know, a lot of that's going to be skewed, though, Errol, too. This is. This is why I always say to you, this is the problem I have with you going, oh, look at the numbers. Look at the – dude, the Chargers were down every game they ever played. So, of course, they were throwing the football. So that Oh, was- they weren't down every single game. They were – how many times did we see the Chargers when they were contenders? They've won if, – if you look at the wins to losses. They were like, he had a great team. Close close he games. had a great they team. Do. They, they, were, lo- they, they lose by single digits. 11-5, 13-3. 
uh, nine and seven, uh, nine and seven, twelve and four. I mean, he had they they were good teams. They were good teams. And Early in his losing. career, yes. It doesn't matter. They won, and he he was the one of the main reasons why. And by the way, how many quarterbacks in a row threw almost five thousand yards in seven compl- in seven seasons in a row? 4,710, 4,624, 4,478. I mean, 4,792. I mean, Philip Rivers was a fantastic quarterback. He is. He's one of the greats. Top 10. To say he's top 10 all time is He is. His numbers will show you that it is. His numbers would absolutely show you that he is. Okay. Yeah, you you want to know what number keeps him from being in my top 10? What is it? Super Bowl's one. That's fine. And or I, appeared in. Uh, that's that's fine. And well, I, my answer, was he even in a conference exactly. championship? That, yes, and, once. My my answer to that is it has a lot to do with team two, Jeff. It's not one player that wins games for you. You need everything to work you on just, all cylinders. You just got done saying they had really good teams and they were always the, yeah. they weren't always behind. Yeah, they had really good and we've teams. seen a lot of so great teams that never went Super Bowls. We've so why isn't he the twenty ten Chargers is a prime example. Uh, uh, yeah, Ladamian Phil- Thompson on MVP Phillip, year. Philip Rivers is the only person that I know that played with two torn ACLs and played in the game and won. Okay, and won beat the. He's Baltimore tough Raiders. as shit. We did get you, it. Did you just miss Tom Brady do that? A torn LCL and MCL this year and win a Super Bowl? Uh, mm. Did you miss that this yeah. year? Yeah. Mm-hmm. And where was played the, the surgery? And where played, was the surgery? Did we see surgery? Did he have surgery? Did he have surgery? No, he, no, he, no he, played, he, had, he had surgery after the season. He played with them both totally torn the whole season. Totally what turn? What, torn? what did he have totally torn? The LCL and the MCL. If he had the MCL, he shouldn't be walking right now. Okay? No, MCL no, no, is no, a ACL, big injury. ACL's a, Speedy, go pull up the article for him about Tom Brady's surgery he had two weeks ago, so Errol can be like, "Oh, no, I yeah, know he I had, know. I know he had knee surgery. He didn't have his MCL. I don't think it was his yes, MCL. Yes, it was MCL and LCL. MCL is a totally big body. muscle. It's a big muscle. Oh, now we're TB12. It's not, muscle, it's not- good for you." Uh, John also says Matt Ryan, I guess, the listing of quarterbacks that have been similar statistically to Cousins. And then Carl also said you just blamed... I would take Matt Ryan over Kirk Cousins. I would, too. But that, uh, uh, Carl said uh, you had just blamed one player on the Bears for a playoff loss. Come on, Errol. What do you mean I played one player on the... The field goal... They, they should have won that game, Carl. What are you talking about? Well, look at Seattle. When the uh, Minnesota kicker shanked it. Right. Oh my God! Oh yeah, the, ki- the kicker, poor, the kickers are poor. Uh, what's his name? Blair Walsh. He, oh, Blair Walsh. oh boy! Yeah. Oh boy! He was actually a good kicker. For yeah, a while. he was got, until that never, happened. Yeah, <laughs> and then his career went upside down, right. sideways, inside mm-hmm. out. It is a team sport, but when you're up, when you're up, and all you have to do is kick a field goal to win the game, it is that player's fault that he missed a thirty yard. What? It wasn't even thirty yards. It was twenty five yards. If he had thrown one more touchdown pass, oh, they God. don't need the field goal. Oh my God! Oh my God! If it wasn't go, for Mitch Chabinski. There you go, Errol. Rick Stroud, Tampa Bay Times. Mm-hmm. Tom Brady played the entire 2020 season with a completely torn medial collateral ligament, the MCL, mm-hmm. and a partially torn LCL the entire season. He suffered the injury in the final game with the Patriots. Just had surgery. Boom. Okay, and why? And, and so how is he playing? Because that's a significant injury. You have to be out a certain amount of time. How is he going into the season all healthy? Just had surgery two weeks ago. MCL is a major sure. ligament. Yes. Yeah, uh, yeah, he just, yeah, I mean, go go back and look what he did. He put on two braces and then put that, like, metal brace that linemen use on his leg. And, go, and I, I understand. Go look at the MCL and see where the MCL is. There, There's no way you should be playing football. That's what football. goats do. Yeah, that's what goats do. I don't believe that. If, they, if that's true. Billy Goat Brady. If oh, he really... Go, no, I don't go, believe that. Put, Come on, Jeff. On Jeff, there's no way he could step on, on a... Jeff, field. there's no way he could step on a field. I know what an MCL injury is. If he tore his MCL, he should not be playing football right now. He should be sitting out for a significant amount of time. An MCL is a major injury. It's not a meniscus. It's an MCL. That's a huge tear. That's six inches. Five to six inches in the middle of your knee. You can't tell me. Yeah. You can't tell me Get right it. now. What? Get it. Yeah. Well, good. Get I don't it. believe it. Played the whole season. Don't believe it. Don't believe it. Of course you don't. don't believe you also it. didn't think the cut was real. No. You don't think I don't believe that. I don't believe that. I don't believe that. 
Jeff, you can say whatever you want. An MCL injury? I know what an MCL injury is. I've worked with a lot of, first of all, I've trained, I've personal trained people that are trying to get in their knees straight or stronger. An MCL injury is a significant, significant knee injury. If he tore his MCL and he had surgery two weeks ago, he should not be on a football field right what now. What if the TB12 thing really works? Maybe that's why he's it's not. A, it's so stupid. I don't even want to hear it. It's dumb. It's dumb. John, I know what an MCL injury is. John says, if there's no pain and the knee does not give way, they can casually walk, stretch, and do low-impact activities such as swimming. But what does that have anything to do with Tom Brady playing football? But the braces he wore, but the braces he wore those big encumbering braces are what provided the stability. Like, no. It's only a problem if you're not wearing braces, which he – go and huh. look, dude. He got – dude, it was like a – Carl, I meant, first of all, first of all, Carl, I meant a ligament. Why are you trying to correct me, Carl? I know what it is. I've, I've worked with a clients and stuff like that. If you want to see my personal training, my, stati- my certifications, I could show you. I've worked with athletes, ton and ton of athletes. And all when right, you tear, down, when you tear your MCL, that type of ligament, you <laughs> don't go back on the field right away. And I know that for a fact. You're out of the, you're out at least seven yeah, to eight has, weeks. Maybe he even has longer. Surgery two days, he has surgery two days after the parade, bro. Mm-hmm. That's February. Yeah, and he, sh- and, and he shouldn't. It's uh, August. Dude, he was playing golf. He was doing all this other stuff. But golf is just walking. You can't. Do, do you know what an MCL injury is? Do you you know just ACL? said you wear, it takes about seven weeks. Seven to eight weeks to, to, to actually walk. Right. To walk. All you do in golf is walk. Oh, my God. I'm sure Tom Brady had a cat. That's not all you do. Again, Tyler, you're just showing your lack of knowledge. Like, no, it's, I've, it's I've played golf tons of times. There really is no strain that Tom Brady can't overcome while playing a simple yeah, game. Why don't of you golf. just? Why don't you get on your knees and it's suck? It's not. I mean, dude, I mean, you it, just—it's so dumb. It's just—it's it, it. It gives me a headache. Oh, your stupidity. John says Brady was high on cocaine. He won't feel any be feeling anything. LOL. Mm. It, it just, it's sad. Plus, it's he in the, plus he bathes in the fountain of youth every night. Probably mm. does. Probably does. Something I think he else. is the fountain of youth. Yeah, well, it, just like Don't Steph Curry, you have like some kind of love fest for him. So I appreciate good. winning. Yeah, you're winning? Winning. Yeah, winning. Maybe, Brady maybe wins. I, I would say that. But and Steph you can't Curry, even bring up the stupid Belichick thing because Belichick can't win without Brady. Brady's won without how do you, him. How do you know what Belichick can do? Because the first year that he what, didn't what have did Belich- him. What did Belichick? First of all, Belichick, Belichick struggled in the year? league what? until he found Tom what? Brady. What did Belichick? Second of all, first of all, what did Brady Belich- just won without him. Uh, that's congratulations. Also played for one of the most talented teams in the league. Okay, I'm completely showing your lack of knowledge again. Mm-hmm. Seven and nine mm-hmm. the year before mm-hmm. went and won four consecutive games, basically on the road to win a Super Bowl. Nobody is taking. First of all, Bill. First of all, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers had a, a, as talented team in the league bomb as squad. any team. They, they're bomb talented. Squad. They, they were they so had talented. A bomb squad. And Seven and nine the year before, were basically the same. Team. Yeah, with Jameis Winston. Just... With right. Jameis Winston. Who so you love Tom so much? Brady who single-handedly. Who stinks? What's the difference? Who stinks? Who he was love? the biggest difference. Yeah, yeah, biggest difference. Okay, whatever you say. Whatever you say, Tyler. John says Belichick also uh, had nine players opt out. Bucks had all players. I, I get it. I understand. You get And nothing. the Patriots will be you back to nothing. a regular form this year. But Tom Brady was the only difference in winning the Super Bowl. Okay. Whatever you say. Thank you. Congratulations to you. Well, it wasn't the only difference, but it was close. Because they had Antonio Brown and Gronk came in, which was huge. Because if you go back. Only because of Tom Brady. Remember last year. Uh, O.J. Howard went down with an injury. O.J. Right. Howard was tight end one, and he got hurt the second week or something. Hmm. You know, so I mean, yeah. Does Gronk I mean, come out of retirement if Brady stays in New England? No. I mean, yeah. Tyler, okay. yeah. you know, you know what Antonio problem? Brown got kicked Tyler, out of New England. Tyler, you know what your problem is, and it, and this is this is facts. You won't sit back when you when you make your points and you and you go after players and stuff like that, like Bron James. You'll never go back and say, you know, take back what you say because you Why just would I take say, it back. No, I'll because say. you're an idiot. You say LeBron James because you say LeBron James is an elite player. He isn't the best player in the league. I never say he was not elite. Yeah, yeah, I say he's not the best player in the league. You're, that just shows God how stupid me. you are. That just shows you how stupid God you are. God help me. LeBron James couldn't makes everybody be around Kawhi, him better. It couldn't yeah, okay. be Giannis. It just couldn't like be you say, Katie, Tom Brady. Couldn't just be like Curry. LeBron is Tom Brady in basketball. Yes, he is. So it just shows you how stupid you really are. I mean, Why are Tom Brady is definitely the best. So dumb. No, because it pisses me off. This guy, this guy believes whatever he wants, and yes. he doesn't go back and say, you know what, I'm wrong. 
No. Why would I do that? Because it's stupid. Why would I do that? Because you're stupid. That's why. I've never heard you say you've been wrong either. Uh, I'm still waiting for you to come out and say that Panarin is not an Islander. First of all, I say it all the time, and it's Panarin. Panarin. Panarin, Panarin, he's not an Islander, so it doesn't really matter to you, does it? It's Panarin. 